This is what they've done. This? This, yeah. They smashed it all down for me. Nice people. Well, community spirit may be alive and kicking in some places, but for pensioner Rini Kavanagh, it's a daily war against antisocial behaviour. And the front line is right here on her doorstep. Did you see who did this? Well, yeah, because like I say, he was stood at my gate giving me verbal abuse. They've purposely come down to smash my fencing in to frighten me. And that's basically what they've done. What next? I'll move. To? To either into Bolton, if I get offered this house in Bolton, or I will go to New Zealand or Australia. I have a brother-in-law to New Zealand on uh, Waikiki Island. Uh, that apparently there is no criminal activity at all whatsoever. Well, on the basis of what's happened to Rini Kavanagh, it does seem as though community spirit isn't everything that you'd like it to be. But what's the experience of other people? When did you last speak to one of your neighbours? Yesterday morning. Yeah, I look after you know, like, um, clean for and that. Do you? Yeah. Yes, yeah. Have you spoken to your neighbours lately? Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, I always make sure they're all right, because I've got elderly neighbours, so obviously you make sure, especially now, that they reckon the weather's going to be really bad at the moment. I know my neighbours on the right-hand side, and I've got on with them quite well, actually, yeah. Two very different aspects on the subject of community spirit. This is Rini Kavanagh's experience, and that's why this is probably going to be the last Christmas that Rini spends in this community. I'm Kevin Duffy for Channel M News.